This is just stupid shit. Shaz, Shaz in the Shard Army was in the fucking thing earlier talking about business owners and unions. Hey, Shaz, you dumb motherfucker. Are you kidding me? The big three automakers, you think they're you think they're family owned, family run businesses? You are a dumb son of a bitch. Just like Mark Wayne Mullen here, and I bet you'd get your ass kicked by it by a fucking teamster just like Mullen would. I bet that would happen. But let's continue with Mullen here. My wife was running the office because I sure remember working pretty hard and long hours. <laughs> That's not too convincing, is it? He's like, look. Look here. Look here, you. You really big, huge guy. Look like you'd stomp my ass. Listen. Listen. My wife, my wife worked in the office, so she can she can vouch for how many hours I worked. I worked hard. There was a couple every month that I worked really hard. When I went out to the job sites that my guys were working on and I bossed them around and told them what to do, what not to do. Oh, man, I was working really hard when I was doing that kind of shit. Get the fuck out of here, man. You're talking to a fucking teamster, you dumb son of a bitch. Do you, do you have any idea what fucking teamsters are? They're fucking truck drivers, you stupid little prick. These people load and unload trucks. They fucking drive trucks all the way across the country from town to town, load the to load, sometimes not getting any fucking sleep, cooking their books so that they can carry more fucking loads. Yeah, I said it. And you think you're going to convince this guy, this Teamster, that you worked harder than Teamsters? Get the fuck out of here with that nonsense. No one believes that shit, and no one believes what you just said. Hell, listen to it again. Listen to him try to convince us how hard he didn't work. Sir, I wish you was in the truck with me when I was building my plumbing company myself, and my wife was running the office because I sure remember working pretty hard and long hours. <laughs> that, that was his best defense for I work really hard at my daddy's business, see? See, I work really hard that my that my family gave me gave me the money. <laughs> I, that's that's what that's what happened. See, and I worked really hard for all that family business that I inherited. I worked really hard at it. Get the fuck out of here. And my wife, she worked really hard too because she's married to me, so she inherited a job too. Pretends like he's self-made. What a clown! Yeah, you are. Fraud. You are a fraud. Always has been. Always will be. Yep, sure is. Quit the tough guy act in these Senate hearings. You know where to find me. Any place, any time, cowboy. Sir, this is a time, this is a place. You want to run your mouth. We can be two consenting adults. We can finish it here. Okay. Let's look, look, look at the women behind him, by the way. They're like, what the fuck is this guy talking about? What the fuck is he talking about? But listen, listen to what O'Brien says. O'Brien doesn't miss a beat here. We can be two consenting adults. We can finish it here. Okay, that's fine. Perfect. You want to do it now? I'd love to do it right now. Let's stand <laughs> Look at O'Brien. He's like, dude, I will fucking run all up and down your ass. You have no clue. I can't tell you how many fucking fights as an adult Brian has probably been in fist fights that Brian has probably been in. And not just not just for stupid shit like a tweet. Fist fights over his job. I bet the, I bet this guy I bet this guy has been in fights, fist fights, brawls over his fucking work, folks. Mark Wayne Mullen has no fucking clue what he's stepping into. No fucking clue what the hell he's stepping into. And he's about to find out. You fuck around around long enough, you just find out. Watch this. Your butt up then. You stand your butt up. Oh, hold on. Oh, hold, stop it. Is that your Sorry. solution every poll? No, no, sit down. Sit down. Okay, I don't know if you know anything about, like, conflict or violence or brawls or fights or barroom bashes. You know, whatever you want to call it. What, Whatever you want to say. But listen, I'm here to tell you in this instance and in every instance where this happens where the first guy who acts like he's tough and stands up, that's the guy that gets fucking knocked out. That's the guy you see in the restaurant videos or in the bar videos that's getting fucking mouthy with someone he shouldn't be getting mouthy with. 
And all of a sudden, one punch is thrown, and that guy's laying on the floor, limp. Like a piece of spaghetti. That's how it happens every time. Now, watch Mark Wayne Mullen get cucked by Bernie Sanders here. This is this is even more fantastic. Okay. You know, okay. you're a United States senator. Sit down. Oh, okay. okay. Sit down, please. All right. Can I respond? Mr. Hold Sir. it. Hold it. If Hold we can't, no, I have the mic. Said. I'm sorry. This is Hold what it. he said. You'll have your time. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. I'll get my time. Yeah, okay. I'll get my time. I'll get my time. What? Come on. Mark Way Mullen never, never intended to fucking fight O'Brien. And the reason why is because fucking O'Brien would actually beat his ass. O'Brien would, again, stomp a fucking mud hole in his ass. Mark Wayne Mullen knows it. And Bernie Sanders like, sit your fucking ass down. He will kill you. He will murder you in this room. Will you shut the fuck up? Just sit down. You're not doing shit, bitch. <laughs> this guy, this guy will fucking break you in half. Okay. He will rip off your arms and use them to beat you to death with them. Okay. Sit the fuck down. You're not doing shit. I'm not going to be accomplice to a murder in my hearing. Bernie Sanders totally cucks Mullen here. Can I respond? Oh, no, you can't. <laughs> this is a hearing. And God knows the American people have enough of contempt for Congress. Let's not I don't make like it worse. thugs and you, bullies. You have, and you have I don't, don't like you. you. I don't like thugs and bullies. <laughs> Mark Wayne Mullen doesn't like thugs and bullies. But he's going to vote for Trump. Get the fuck out of here with this bullshit. This tough guy, macho man. And get the fuck out of here, man. It's enough of this shit. It's enough of this shit. Honestly, that's why I say let him fight. Fuck, I think Bernie Sanders should put on a goddamn striped shirt. Again, take him down to a goddamn gym. Hook up the fucking turnbuckles and the goddamn the ropes and let these son of a bitches fight. Let them fight. I don't know gloves, whatever, whatever the hell they want to do, whatever the hell Mark Wayne Mullen wants to pick how they want to fight. O'Brien will beat his ass. Let's do that. Hell, we could sell tickets on TV to help the deficit as, as George Carlin says, but listen, Mullen. Hey, 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 Mark Wayne. I want to give you a little fucking clue here. I want to give you a little fucking clue. If you're so fucking tough, you wouldn't have let this old fucking man fucking cuck you, you little bitch. You're not tough. You're not tough, and you're the fucking bully. You're the fucking guy who's got the toxic masculinity, who makes videos with his guns and shit, thinks that he's fucking cool. Get the fuck out of here with this nonsense. And I bet, I bet anyone... Anyone from the from the state of Oklahoma that's named Mark Wayne Mullen or Mark Wayne in general or just has two first names combined to make one would always, always get their fucking ass stomped in. Especially if Bernie Sanders, look at this, look at this, how he cucks him. Watch, I'm going to do it. But yeah, 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 but yeah, yeah. Oh, hold on. Oh, hold, stop it. Is that your All solution right. every poll? Oh. No, no, sit down. Sit down. Okay. You know, you're a United okay. States Senator. Act it. Oh, okay. Sit down, please. All right. Can I respond? Mr. Hold Trump. it. Hold it. Bernie Sanders as the referee here. Totally cucks Mark Wayne Mullen. Proves the point that Mark Wayne Mullen ain't doing shit. 